What up, though, Heist Man the Foe? Talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions, man. We'll talk about something a little different right now. I want to talk about this movie called Street Fighter. Y'all remember that movie Street Fighter? It came out in the early 90s. Back then, they was um, taking video games and making them into movies, and it was a big thing. They did Street Fighter, they did Mortal Kombat, Resident Evil, a whole plethora of movies and genres. I guess some of the words I want to use, plethora and genre. But anyway, the thing about Street Fighter is I didn't really, the thing about it I didn't really like about it, you know, there's a lot of things I didn't like about Street Fighter, but the thing I didn't like the most was the cast. I don't feel like this was the right cast to have for Street Fighter. Maybe it was the 90s and they was picking people, but... I mean, the lack of fighting, they ain't really had that much fighting in a Street Fighter movie, you know? Based off the video game, I thought it was going to be more of a tournament mode type situation, but it wasn't like that. It was like RPG, role-playing game, basically, the way they did the movie. But the cast really didn't... I ain't really like that. For starters... Guy, Guy was a U.S. Army man, Marine, soldier, something like that. And who did they get to play him? The muscles from Brussels. That accent, I couldn't get past the accent of Jean Claude Jean Claude Van Damme. I couldn't get past that being a he supposed to be a U.S. Marine or Army guy, something like that. Blase, blase. And he was a lead character, and I didn't, I didn't know. That's just one of them, man. Um, Raul Julia, pretty dope. I think he did a good job in that playing M. Bison. But the only thing I can see is Gomez. Gomez Adams. That's the only thing I can think of when I was watching that. Gomez Adams. I'm like, I don't know. Who else? Chun Lee. I think they did Chun Lee. They did justice with her, but I mean, just put an Asian woman in, fix her hair, and do karate. So, you know, I kind of, man, I don't know about that. It's, probably, it's pretty cool. I think I can deal with that one. Who else? Cammy. I think Cammy was dope. I mean, she had to do them put on a leotard, not a leotard, the snap in the middle of the, of the crotch area. Y'all know what I'm talking about, man. I think that's pretty good. Who else? E Honda and um Zang Zangief. They're pretty good, you know. They didn't really do much. I'm saying I don't know, man. The the casting was pretty hmm. Saget, Vega, they was alright. They did pretty good. Oh, this is what I really didn't like. Right here. Ken and Raul. Ken and Raul, I don't know, man. Raul, maybe. Maybe. You know? He's an Asian man. He can play that. But Ken, I don't know, man. Ken is played by Damien Chopper. If y'all know Damien Chopper, i never seen Damien Chopper play a white man in a movie, ever. He always been a vato loco. He always been, like, one of the toughest Mexicans you ever seen in a movie. Miklo. Mm, so that's why I, I, I ain't really feel them inside of that role. Um, he didn't have the hair of Ken, you know. Hold on, that ain't him. He didn't really have the hair. Only thing they had on was the red suit and the, and the white suit. I ain't really like that though, man. Um, who else? Who else? Who else? Ah, oh, this was the one. DJ, look at DJ. I think DJ came off Street Fighter too. Who they get to play him? Miguel Nunez, aka Joanna Man, aka Biscuit from Life. I'm just saying, man. These was kind of crazy. This is what DJ supposed to look like. They get Joanna Man to play him or Biscuit from Life. Maybe it's just me. That's how I feel. But every time I see this movie, I go back and look like when it come on, I see it, I scroll through. So I'll be looking like, man, I just don't like this cast. Um, They did they did provide a movie for us growing up. They have Street Fighter as a movie. But it really didn't do good. They tried to come back with another one. But, hmm. Maybe I I just wanted more of the tournament mode and to see these people fighting versus all of them grouped up on teams fighting, you know. If they had a tournament style, maybe they need to do the movie again because I think they're making a new video game, Street Fighter Six. I think that's what it is coming out. So, yo, maybe they do a movie about this, you know, about this movie, about Street Fighter Six, about this video game, and maybe we have something better, man. Y'all let me know. Um, y'all put it down in the comment section how y'all feel about this. How y'all feel about Street Fighter the movie? That came out on TV. Like I said, R.I.P. to um, Raul Julia. He did his thing, man. He, he was he was a good M. Bison. <clears throat> um, but everybody else, you know, like I said, E. Honda, he he fit the bill. He a sumo wrestling um man from Japan, sumo wrestler. Um, Zangief, he was big and all that stuff. They really do the moves. I think they had Blanca, Taoism and stuff. They look all right, but I'm saying like, hmm, maybe it's just me. 
But we definitely gonna be talking about this Friday right here on this channel because I go live every Friday talking about stuff just like this. You just gotta come through and holler at me, man. Hit that like button, the comment button, the share button, the subscribe button, the notification bell. All them good buttons you got to hit to get this pepper that I'm putting out when I put it out. And like I said, I go live every Friday at 9 p.m. Come through, join the conversation. And tell me how you feel about Street Fighter 2 or Street Fighter the movie. Cast. Blase, blase, blase. Anyway, how I let your boy. Heist Man the Foe. Talk that talk. Ghetto news and opinions. Peace.